It was a battle of the bands, but it didn't happen on stage. We're getting a look at the injuries after a fight on the south side. Channel 11's Vince Sims found out police are investigating this brawl. Vince? Yes, we first started getting emails about it, and I wanted to make sure it was legitimate, so I checked with police. They said there was an assault here on the south side. Two young men were attacked by six unknown attackers. Well, at the time, I checked with the police, and now the victim is giving me his side of the story. People told me they don't like my dad. I didn't jump them. But that's what 23-year-old drummer Corey Muro says happened when he and a friend criticized another band called Broken Side. Yeah, we just told them we don't like their band and what they stand for, and they just jump us. Police say six unknown people assaulted Muro and Johnny Grishecki here on Carson Street between Dee's Cafe and Smiling Moose Bar. Muro says a member of Broken Side sucker punched Grishecki, and that's when he jumped in. I, I grabbed the guy, choked out on him, and gone to the ground. And next thing I knew, I was getting kicked in the head by several people. I blacked out for a couple seconds. Muro had to get three staples in his head. Grishecki also had injuries to his face. We searched online, and on Broken Side's Twitter page, the band claims they have injuries as well, saying, yes, one of our guys has a messed up arm and a piercing ripped out bleeding, but you don't see us complaining. Broken Side also denies the assault, tweeting, let's clear this up. We didn't jump anyone. It was one-on-one, -on -one, and the other guy jumped in. We ain't posting pics or crying. We're dealing with it. And so is Bureau by providing police with descriptions of the suspects. I hope they'll never come to Pittsburgh again, and I hope that they meet some cops at the next stops. And Muro has also told me that he's hoping that on the south side that sees a lot of fights and incidents, he hopes this doesn't shine more bad light on it or the two bars that it happened outside of, because he says the bars were actually helpful in them dealing with the chaotic aftermath. Reporting live on the south side of Vince Sims, Channel 11 News. Your severe weather.